hey guys welcome to the channel so first of all if you're new here then please subscribe to the channel first and hit the bell icon so you get regular updates I will be doing today is sulfuric acid it is a very small drug and I was studying it for uh, Hit Shiksha which is a page by Dr. Hitesh Farya I'll put the uh, Instagram handle in the description below and I realized that it is such an easy drug because I could remember the drug completely in just two words. Not even kidding, the first word being an alcoholic. So when we say alcoholic, we mean somebody who has been consuming large amount of alcohols for a good amount of duration, right? Um, and if you've studied alcohol poisoning well, you know there are three stages. First is stage of excitement, then comes stage of incoordination and third comes stage of narcosis. Sulfuric acid briefly fits in stage of incoordination. So first of all, uh, it has both acute as well as chronic consequences of being an alcoholic. In acute, as I mentioned, there are three stages. It fits roughly in the stage of incoordination, SOI. The word in itself suggests that there is going to be incoordination. So first symptom being trembling. There is sensation of trembling all over without real trembling. So the person is just experiencing trembling. Second sensation, anybody who's had a little too much of alcohol knows about vomiting. The vomiting is sour plus the eructations are sour. When there are sour eructations, there is offensive breath right so this is second part third when there is stage of incoordination the person really is not very well with his senses so there is easy chance of injury easy injury now if you've read alcohol poisoning you will notice that a lot of death due to alcohol are because of the easy injuries because the person doesn't really have great pain perception at when he's high on alcohol, right? So there is one ailment from which says bad effects of mechanical injury. And uh, there is again a symptom of misjudgment. That is the person doesn't have good amount of judgment and he may get into fights and injure himself. There is a symptom of intraocular hemorrhage after trauma which I think is most likely after getting into a fight, or at least that is what you can think to remember the drug. The post effect of an acute drinking episode is headache, or which people usually call as hangover. The sensation is as if the brain was loose. The pain is more in the occiput. This sensation is also there in Belladonna and the person feels better by holding hands near the head. So I'll just write holding. When we talk about pain, the important aspect of pain here is, in the remedy is, the pain is gradual and slow, reaches a sudden height and then ceases suddenly. Okay, and this is repetitive. So it will be gradual and it will reach out to height and it will cease. This is similar to pulse. This is the pain diagram of sulfuric acid. We can also associate trembling to jerking a bit when writing. Okay, so like I mentioned, this was stage of incoordination. This third stage is stage of narcosis. The person, um, there is one mental symptom which is suggestive of stage of narcosis that is unwilling to answer, not due to obstinacy, obstinacy but due to inaptness. Okay. So this Another important mental symptom of the drug is hurry. So if you read Soul of Remedies, Dr. Sankaran goes on and on about uh, the patient of sulfuric acid being in great hurry because he wants to get things done. So the hurriness is mainly because of anxiety. 
the anxiety is more in the morning when he has planned things that i'm going to do so and so and it is better in the evening when those things are done right also if you see reverse appetization hurry while eating hurry while writing all of the those rubrics have sulfuric acid which also may be signifies jerking when writing so this is the mental symptoms of sulfuric acid now coming to the chronic part of being an alcoholic first of all and the easiest one is vitamin deficiency this will cause apathy of mouth and bleeding gums before that something between acute and chronic a, an alcoholic has one important symptom and that is craving okay so there is sensation as if water drunk uh, is causing uh, coldness in the stomach and unless mixed with alcohol he will not take it i'll repeat it sensation as if water drunk causes coldness of stomach unless mixed with alcohol right so this is the most important symptom of the drug vitamin deficiency could also be because of some other cause like marasmus or pm or malabsorption syndrome we'll get to it later okay then a person who has been vomiting continuously who is an alcoholic and who's been drinking too much and has been vomiting continuously will have teeth deformities sets teeth on edge right also continuous vomiting will lead to gastralgia in gastralgia the prominent desire is a fresh food and aversion to smell of coffee right also when we are talking about git another important area of affection in an alcoholic is liver so there are two components one is sorry about that there is fatty deposition and another long term consequence could be cirrhosis otherwise if there is liver deformity or derangement there is clotting mechanism that is uh, hampered right so this clotting mechanism being hampered can give rise to purpura ekymosis in the symptom mentioned is livid red itching blotches and the past healed turn red and blue and are painful the easy injury can also give rise to gangrene again if there are comorbidities of course so i will consider it more towards chronic side and if this is like because lowered immunity and other comorbidities which also signifies another important symptom that is of boils and carbuncles the clotting defect will also cause bleeding from all outlets and the blood is black and fetal right um one correlation people are usually with a fat stomach are called beer bellies and obese people have easy hernia but this guy has sensation of hernia or hernia would protrude mainly on the left side so this is the chronic symptom so this was our word one alcoholic which almost covers 90% of the drug picture the second one is women at climaxes right so here the bleeding is profuse and early
there are hot flushes okay and the symptoms are fairly suggestive of ca, CA cervix because there is acrid and burning leucorrhea there is easy bleeding one like when i said about marasmus there is one important child symptom that is uh, the child smells sour it, even after being washed thoroughly despite careful washing so smells sour this is the only child symptom in the drug this is sulfuric acid for you people i hope you liked it and please like the video if you liked it after this i'll be starting mainly with biochemic drugs maybe one more video and then i'll do biochemic all of them and i'll be posting more often so i suggest that you hit the bell icon because i might not always put it on my socials when a video comes up so for your own benefit hit the bell icon thank you so much